still an on understanding how um traffic traffic is being forwarded across network devices today we are using a switch and then switches are very intelligent we are going to see how traffic is being forwarded from one port to the other and uh, without the other port knowing what's going on switches um resolve mac address of every device on its ports um to enable a unique traffic that means um a pc1 is speaking to pc3 pc2 has no duty there to uh, intercept what is going on unlike um when you are using halves so let's go ahead and configure these pieces i'm going to configure pc1 to use the ip address 10 so as shown in our previous videos this is how to configure ip address for pieces in gns3 that's for pc1 and um, let me configure for pc2 okay So IP turn 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 two two four five two four five and two four five so there. So for PC three will be ten to three. One thing I want you to notice is um the MAC addresses of the devices connected. Now switches so learn MAC addresses by from devices connected to it dynamically. So at the moment the switch is down. The moment we turn it up, we turn it on. Sorry, we are going to see the MAC address of the MAC address table of the switch being populated by the MAC address of um, these various devices. So let me go ahead and start it. Start the switch. Right. So let me open the console and do show MAC address table. Okay, so let me try to ping on um, PC1. So let me ping PC3, ping on um, 10, nothing, nothing, dot um, 3. And it's applying. So let me go ahead and Okay, so this is okay. So show my address table, and as you can see, this is the my address of um, PC one. So as you can see, it ended in zero zeros, and um. Here's the MAC address of um, PC3. What is PC3? PC3. And then um, that's PC3. 03. So at the moment, this is the unicast traffic. It's happening from um, PC1 and to PC3. PC2 has no interception between that communication, and therefore, its MAC address hasn't been learned yet. On the MAC address table. So on PC3, let me ping um, PC2. 10, 10, 10 .2. Now, should we check our MAC address table to be populated with the MAC address of PC2? And there we have it. So this is 01, and that's 01 for PC. So, MAC addresses are used in switch to 
for traffic um, to be sent from one PC to the another and this avoids collusion unlike using hubs where um, every device in the network will receive the traffic and then we will also uh, it will also intercept communication between devices so this is one way um, to show how switches are learned MAC addresses of um, devices dynamically and how this is update its MAC table so when and traffic will be sent from uh, PC1 to PC3 there will be a unicast traffic from PC1 to PC3 meaning no other device can intercept what's going on between these devices thanks for watching